Dexter, to get another shot at the Eagles. How much are you looking forward to that? I'm looking forward to the battle. Um, you know, third time, you know, just trying to come out with a different result this time. Do you look at New York and Philadelphia grit, both teams with that kind of mindset? Uh, for sure. Um, you know, both prideful places. And, um, you know, I know their fans going to be out there. And, you know, I hope we travel well. How do you describe that environment? <laughs> like he said, gritty. Uh, hard nose. I told my mom she can't come to the games. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, because you get go back at them, but um, it should be fun, and I'm excited. But what makes their offensive line a, a challenge? To deal with? Uh, they some big dudes, and um, physical. They got a good leader in Kelsey, and um, you know, uh, you know, we help them learn a lot, and, and you know, they can they can latch on to you pretty good. When you look back at the film from that first matchup, the 48 to 22 loss, what was the biggest thing that stood out to you with the defensive mistakes? Uh, we didn't play well, and, and they attacked us. Um, they did a good job with that, and you know we just had to play well and make less mistakes um, to to be able to compete. How much do you think the D has grown since that first matchup? Um, I think we've grown a lot. You know, just we we grew, we grew together, then apart during that time, and um, I think that kind of shows in the play. So, you know, we just keep that confidence and that and that want to to be there for each other and you know play for each other and we be good. Are you looking back at all, like, hey, we got here? Or are you looking ahead to what else we can do? Um, I think it's you know it's just ahead right now. You know, this is a new season. Um, we want to know right now and. You know, the Eagles the Eagles in our way right now. You mentioned Kelsey Dex. He's not the biggest guy, but he's able to get his job done for the Hall of Famer, right? Mm -hmm. How is he able to play so well, even though he's a little undersized for the position? Uh, He's little and he's strappy, scrappy. Like, he, um, he know how to get his body in good position. Um, you know, he, 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 he know how to he know how to manipulate um, D, D linemen. Um, and the guards do a good job, you know, pounding down and helping when he, when he needs it. Dex, last week, Wink was speaking about the moment where he realized this was a playoff defense. Obviously, you're still alive, so you are playoff defense. But do you remember the moment you or even a conversation that took place with teammates where there was something that clicked and something on the field that showed you? Um, I think as players, we all see we all see each, like like how we see it. We all see think we are, you know, we can be whatever we want to be, the, the best, the greatest, all these things. Um, you know, but for a coach to say that, you know, it just helps build that confidence that we're seeing the right things. And, you know, he's he's been he's seen it before. He's seen a good defense before. And so for him to say that it just builds extra confidence for us. But as players, we always talk about it and we always try to be about it. This robbery is always intense. Now you add the playoffs to it. What does that do, the intensity of this game? Um, I think it's always an intense physical game. And um, I'm excited for that. I like those type of battles. Um, you know, just a, a little more in stake now, and you know, winner winner wins all, and loser go home. Why do you like those battles? What is it about? Um, you know, just in, in having a ba battle with somebody. What do you mean by that? Well, it's just, Not, does it ratchet up to do something inside you? Um, I think it's probably just a pride thing. It's more like, okay, um, you know, you're going against a, a great guy. You want to you want to beat him more than he beats you, type of thing. When you have a mobile quarterback like Jalen, is there anything from the attack point that you have to be more cognizant of because he can slip out? Yeah, it's more just being disciplined. If that's in your rush lanes or if that's um, in your run in your run lanes, you just got to be more disciplined with a guy like that, a dual threat guy, and um, you know, plan on doing a better job at that. Dexter, what's it, what is it like for you personally to, to be in the playoffs to have this big opportunity? Well, it feels good. Um, you know, uh, it, I feel like it's just it's more than just about me, and I'm here for for my guys, and I want to win for my guys. So, you know, I hold all that on me. Um, you know, just being consistent every week and, and dominating. Why Why do you think this team is here? Why do you think you played this well this year? Uh, just the resiliency we had um, through adversity. Uh, we stay strong. We stay positive. We stay with each other, and um, you know that just that just shows a lot in the leadership that we have.